We're here with forward Emma Fernandez after a 2 nothing, two nothing victory against Jackson State on Friday. And for, first, I'll, uh, I'll uh, get to your uh, get to your goal. I mean, uh, uh, the team was a uh, the team was applying pressure so much. I mean, Sabrina had just scored a few minutes before that. I mean, uh, we're, uh, what were you what were you thinking on that? What do you see on that shot? It was a free kick. It was kind of after a long stoppage as well. I mean, uh, what did you see? It was kind of it just kind of found a hole and then, then uh, <laughs> found the uh, found the back of the net, bottom right. Yeah, I mean. Um... I mean, those are the things that we practice in practice. And um, I think it's just like taking care of set pieces. Like those are big opportunities for you. And I think a game like this where like you have a very like competitive team, a very physical team, it's like when you have those opportunities, you just got to put them away. And it's what I try to do for my team and try to put us up 2-0. Yeah, and then uh, the offensively, it was a, it's been a, it's been kind of a, a little bit of a struggle uh, to find the, uh, back the, uh, find the back of the net. But you were able to do that. You guys had a lot of uh, a lot of chances prior to that, but you were finally were able to see, uh, put the ball in the back of the net uh, today. I mean, that's got to be a nice feeling. Yeah, absolutely. Love to do that for the girls. I mean, they hype me up, so and they put their trust in me when we have those opportunities. So it's really nice to be able to do that for my team. Yeah, you you were credited with the assist on the uh, on the first goal of scored by Sabrina. Did you uh, uh, on the free kick? Did you uh, did you attempt to? Uh, did you uh, that uh, kind of the of the goal just nail it off the crossbar and hit it right down to her? I mean, that's got to be a that's got to be a nice play. Ian might uh, have to uh, put that one in the playbook. <laughs> that that would be something. Um, that takes a lot of accuracy. But no, I mean those set pieces. It's like when you're in and around the 18 yard box. It's like can we try to find a shot? And if we can have a shot, or if it deflects off of somebody, can we have somebody who's hungry enough to get on the end of the ball? And that's exactly what Sabrina did. She did her job, and I mean you could tell that everybody else in the box was also fighting for that. Like. It was just really awesome to see that ball. It doesn't go into the back of the net initially, but it's like everybody's working so hard to try to get it there. Yeah, and then what to do uh, offensively for you for you guys? I mean, two uh, two goals. I mean, uh, you guys uh, took what ha took what uh, took uh, what uh, has been working the last few games. The starting kind of in the second half against Southern Miss, I and mean, you guys have been really able to uh, to find some chances, uh, and you were able to connect, uh, connect to that. Yeah. <laughs> And then, uh, you know, finally, what does uh, what does do going forward? Uh, I asked this question to Sabrina as well. Uh, I mean, the uh, conference play is coming up um, starting next week. I mean, uh, it's got to be nice to get two wins. Obviously, you have a difficult one on Sunday against LSU, but this kind of uh, gets you going right in the, in the right direction, uh, moving into conference play. Yeah, hopefully, this just can set us in like a good mind space. LSU is a big. Com Competitor, and I mean it's going to be a little bit of a different ball game, but hopefully we can take this energy, move it into the next game, and hopefully just keep rolling and get ready for conference. Take the big dog and battle as hard as we can. Yeah, thank you, Emma. Yeah, absolutely.